हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू द नेक्स्ट लेक्चर ऑन द दिसंबर 2023 एग्जामिनेशन सॉल्यूशन टुडे आई विल कवर द क्वेश्चन रिलेटेड टू द आइगन वैल्यू प्रॉब्लम माय सेल्फ डॉक्टर हरीश कर यू कैन सिंपली फॉलो माय यूट्यूब चैनल हेयर इज अ प्ले लिस्ट ऑफ द सी नेट एंड यू कैन सी देर इज अ कंप्लीट सी नेट दिसंबर ट्वेंटी सोल्यूशन एंड द टॉपिक वाइज मेमरी बेस्ड क्वेश्चन एज वेल एज यू कैन सी a complete csr net 11 to 23 with the help of the shortcut tricks such as matrix space ordinary differential equation partial equation and many more are available in this lecture once you watched all this lecture you will clear all this exam very simply okay now let's start with this one so before i start this question if you remember my tips whenever what i gave you the tips in my earlier lecture whenever you will see a, a matrix whenever you will see a matrix like this whatever the matrix is there is a n cross n whenever you will see a matrix always think on the eigen value problem whatever whether if you look about this option none of the option is related to the eigen value but i told you whenever you see a matrix always apply the concept of the eigen value i again repeat whenever you will see a matrix always apply the concept of the eigen value problem then you can solve this problem within a 10 to 15 second how you can so see my approach in this lecture so let's start with this one how you can solve this firstly find the eigen value so it's a lambda square minus of 4 and there is no need okay find plus minus 5 is equal to 0 fine so this is lambda minus 5 and lambda plus 1 is equal to 0 so you can see eigen values are my 5 and minus 1 find this is the eigen value but there is one more method there is no need to write this you can see each column sum is my 5 so definitely one eigen value is my 5 and we know the trace is my 4 so definitely the other eigen value is minus 1 now once you know the eigen value once you know the matrix do you know any of the relation any of the relation between the matrix and what is that this is the polynomial do you know any of the relation any of the term which is relate matrix and the polynomial yes that's the kelly hamilton theorem so what is the property of the kelly hamilton theorem that means eigen value will satisfy this fine now you can satisfy the equations so firstly i can choose the eigen value as minus 1 if i substitute here this is my minus 1 minus 4 plus 7 plus 11 Plus one minus of ten is minus a plus b. So what is that? This is minus five plus seven. It's a two. It's a plus twelve minus of ten again a two. So four is minus a plus b. Fine. Now look about the second eigen value. Second eigen value is my five. So I can substitute the five. It's a five raised to power five minus four into five raised to power four. Seven into five raised to power cube. 11 into 5 raised to power 2 minus 5 minus 10 is 5a plus b. Now you may think about that, sir. It's a very large calculation. There is no need to think about the large calculation. Look at the first two terms. I can take 5 raised to power 4 as a common. The remaining is 5 minus 4. That's a 1. So this part is only 5 raised to power 4. From these two cases, I can take 5 raised to power 2 as a common. So the remaining part is 11 minus 35 so what is that it's a minus 24 into 5 raised to power 2 minus 15 is 5a plus b so what is that again i can take as a 5 square common remaining is 25 minus 24 so it is only 5 square that's 25 minus 15 now you can see calculation becomes a very simple so 10 is 5a plus b fine now you have the two equation can you solve them you can subtract them you will get a as a 1 and once you get b as a 5 so you will get a as a 1 b as a 5 now look at that whether the first option is correct wrong a 5 plus a plus b is less than 7 correct a plus b is divisible by 6 correct a is greater than b is a wrong option so if if some other options are there like a plus b is divisible by 4 you can see a plus b is not divisible by 4 if any other options are there because this is a memory based question 
if you find any other option you can check based on the values of this a and b so you can see whenever you will see the matrix always apply the concept of the eigen value look at the second question as i as i already explained you this like this question but again because this is the eigen value what is the tips as i given you whenever there is a form of the n what is the smallest value of the n according to this is 3 fine so you can construct a matrix which is a 3 cross 3 so what is that a i j what is the a 1 1 a 1 1 is product of the i j what is the a 1 2 is a 2 A one three, three. What is the A two one? It's a two, four, six. A three one, A three two, A three six. Then one of the eigen value of this. So clearly say now can you find the eigen values of this? So clearly say what is the rank of this? Clearly if you look about this, if I say one two three and zero zero zero, zero zero zero, fine. So what is the rank of this matrix? Rank is my one. What is the nullity? Nullity is my three minus one two. What does the meaning of the nullity? It means it has. What is the nullity means? That is a kernel. Fine. So it means it has two eigen values corresponding to the zero. So eigen values are zero and zero. What is the third eigen value? You can find from the trace. So what is the trace? Is forty. So these are my eigen value. So one of the eigen values zero is none of this. I choose n is my three. So it, the first option is cancel. This is three, but eigen value is my fourteen. Cancel. It is three into four over two, which is not equal to fourteen. This is cancel. Only left option is my here. But I can check it whether this is the fourteen or not. You can see three, four, six plus one seven over six. So three two three two. So fourteen. You can see d is my. correct answer of this problem so it's a very simple always remember my shortcut tricks whenever you see a matrix always apply the concept of the eigen value if you if you want to find some more lectures on this uh, still one more are there you can simply follow this playlist and find the eigen values lecture you can see a topic wise lectures are available you always look for this uh, lecture and find the eigen values lecture in this case If you want to find some more tips, you can simply scan and join my WhatsApp group. Till now, you can simply like, share, and comment on my video. Best of luck, students. Happy learning, always.